Alright guys, episode 38 of my horror movie reviews. Today I'm going to be reviewing Caged. Um, also the original title for this is Captifs. This is French, um, English subtitles. It was made in 2010, just released here in 2011. Um, directed and co-wrote by Jan Goslan. Produced by Alain Binguigui and Thomas Verhager. Um, also co-wrote by Guillaume Le Mans. Um, the cast, Zoe Felix as Carol, um, this is the woman on the front. Um, Matthias is played by Eric Savin. Um, Samir is played by Ari Elmarlan. Um, Anna is played by Margot um, Guinea. Um, the Doctor is played by Philip Kaharjach. Um, and the synopsis of this is in war-torn Eastern Europe, a young nurse named Carol saves vulnerable lives as part of a humanitarian aid group. Soon her mission will be over and it will be time to return home. But what seems like a shortcut to freedom soon turns into a journey of agonising torturous pain beyond the human threshold. Pulled from their vehicle by a brutal group of armed masked assailants, Carol and two of her colleagues are held captive within an isolated underground bunker. Initially, assuming that the kidnapping is po politically motivated, the truth is far more horrific than they could have possibly imagined. Now, Carol's only mission is to survive, but it's a living hell where staying alive is one thing, but staying in one piece is another. My opinions on this, um, the film is like a mixture between Hostel and Paradise Lost, um, and is very well made. Um, the idea of being captured in Eastern Europe and not knowing what for, then seeing your fellow captives being took away and cut to pieces in order for their organs to be sold, um, is very chilling in my opinion. Um, it's like similar to what's happening in, in Afghanistan where they get kidnapped, they don't know what's happening to them, they don't know whether they're going to get away or get their heads cut off, and that to me um, is very scary. Um, I still think this story, even though it's been told um, loads of times by um, filmmakers like Eli Roth and so on, um, there's still plenty um, to be used with it. Um, I do enjoy these type of stories and it's very nice to see the French's take on that sort of um, sub-genre. Um, I think the director did a good job and there was a scene where Carol is strapped to a medical table um, full of blood waiting to get her eye removed which was very suspenseful the music and as she's waiting there she can hear him messing around with the tools um, he also puts like a clamp in her eye to open her eyelids up so that he can scoop the eye out and that to me was um, very suspenseful how that was done um, the acting was really good from all of the cast and the bad guys looked like they were straight out of the film Hostel um, and the Eastern European Doctor in this was ultra creepy. When you see this, look at the Doctor, he's so scary. You wouldn't like him stood over you with a scalpel ready to take something from you, trust me. If you turned up at your doctor's for some sort of operation and this guy come out, you'd run and you'd just put up with the illness or put up with the problem that you got. Um, the violence, blood and gore was good and very realistic, as you would imagine from something like this, a type of film like this. Um, the masks for um, some of the bad guys were very creepy and good. Um, the only problem I didn't, I, I had with this is that when um, they showed it, uh, some of the injuries, they didn't actually show you the injuries happen. They showed you the aftermath of them. I would have liked to have seen them get cut up. Um, it did show you a few things like that, but not as much as I would have liked. Um, there was also a good scene where Carol has a fight with a big European, Eastern European woman in this like kitchen and while they're fighting Carol stabs her and then drowns her in a big bucket of water and she's sticking her head in and it takes a while because this woman is really strong she's really big so yeah I really enjoyed that um, and overall I thought it was a good film and although not as good as the top French films like High Tension, Inside, Frontiers, The Pack um, I think it was still an entertaining film and better than some of the recent ones like Humane's and Stranded. So yeah, I would recommend this. Definitely if you're into French horror, check this out. If you like stuff like Hostel 
um, not so much so but Paradise Lost stuff like that torture films then check it out if you can put up with the subtitles so thanks guys I'm gonna give this a 6 out of 10 I would recommend you check it out it's a pretty decent film thank you I'll see you all soon